So it looks like uh, someone called and uh, got the um, SWAT team sent to uh, David Hogg's house. Uh, he's that Parkland guy that was um, became suddenly very anti-gun. You know, he was he was used by the uh, liberal media once again. I mean, that, that's that's what the liberal media does: use people to uh, further their agenda. But uh, in this in this situation right here, he was frankly the freaking victim. I'll, I'll call him a victim because they 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 called and, and reported. You know, had a fake reporting and then ended up uh, getting a SWAT team called to his house, saying that there was somebody with AR-15 or something like that. So now, the the what I'm going to say here is. This really can go two ways. Um, two ways in that this could have been a person that, you know, doesn't like him, pro-gun, wants to further an, further an agenda and stuff like that and, uh, you know, call, the, call them on his house out of spite. But this could also be, this can also be a situation where Someone on the anti-gun side that's 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 anti-gun called and did this to make people that are pro-gun look bad. It's kind of like almost switcheroo or something where they're able to to make it look like that's what it was because of how much how bad that looks on the pro-gun people. Uh, you know, it's kind of like going into some of these YouTube sections. You'll see you'll see certain people make. Uh, 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 racist remarks and stuff like that and 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 it was probably somebody black it, it could have been not that there aren't any a lot of white people on YouTube that are uh, that are racist I've seen it so uh, but the thing is is that if you do that you go on there and say something or someone uh, white or or someone goes on to any platform and tries to say you know inflammatory things racist or misogynistic things really just to just to prove or just to make that person out to be more of a victim. And that's probably, and it looks like that's probably a, a situation that could have been very, very much uh, uh, real here in this situation. And, you know, this makes David Hogg out to be a victim. And so him being a victim, you're going to say, hey, look at these evil freaking uh, pro-gun people calling, the, uh, calling and getting a SWAT called on this guy. It could have been that situation. Anyway, I mean, if that if that was somebody that legitimately did that on the pro gun side, and that, that that's really ridiculous that you would do something like that. It's freaking childish, and it makes no goddamn sense. You're not, and you're not helping. You're not helping. If you if you did something like that and you think it's funny, whatever you, that's not helping. It's not helping at all because you know most people deal on feelings. Most people deal on feelings. And if they're gonna feel that you just outright, that side is just outright being mean, well, there you go. But I don't really know how you would stop it if, if, if the people that are doing this are doing this to further their agenda, their anti-gun agenda by making people on the other side look bad by calling and getting a SWAT call on this guy. You can go either way. But uh, those are the two ways that I looked at it. And there's really, to be quite frank and honest, Unless they find the person that did it, there's really no way to know exactly how this, or exactly, you know, what the what the motivation behind that actually was. Anyway, regardless of what, as much as I don't like the kid for what he's done, I don't know him personally, but what I don't like what he did, as far as uh, getting in front of the cameras and you know and trying to you know trying to further some some agenda just to get some FaceTime is what it seems. Hey, he doesn't deserve that. No one deserves that. So anyway, comment, like, share, subscribe, and all that. And it's uh, time for me to go and enjoy the rest of the day. Bye.